Welcome back to American Agenda. Before the break, we spoke with Professor Alan Dershowitz explaining the altercation between himself and former friend uh, Larry David. And that poses the question, are Americans no longer capable of having civil discourse? Rapid fire with our panel right now. Uh, Derek, we'll start with you. What do you think? It's, it's tough. I mean, I think that we've been accelerating toward this direction for some time. I would, I would pin it probably around uh, Bush's uh, presidency. Uh, we had Obama saying, get in their faces. He was talking about uh, talking about liberal politics during Thanksgiving. And so I just think that it's, it's we're rapidly getting to the point where we're separating ourselves into political tribes and we cannot talk to someone else. We don't have a, the, the common humanity between one another anymore if they don't agree with our politics. And so specifically relating to, to Alan Dershowitz, radio host Dennis Prager has said this for three or four years, that there's a difference between being a liberal and being a leftist. And I think that distinction mm. is growing mm. even further apart. And so I think we start should start referring to people who cannot talk to one another uh, in this way as leftists because liberals still have yeah. open minds. They still have open mm -hmm. minds. And I think that's what we, we need as, okay. as, as a country. Okay, quickly, Amy. Forward. I agree with Derek, uh, uh -huh. especially with the differentiation of liberals versus the left um, or the extreme progressives at this point that are leaning towards socialism. I do have a number of Democratic friends that do have common sense and are very mm -hmm. kind. However, mm -hmm. the further to the left you go, the more accepting of violence, the less acceptance of mm -hmm. police officers. Um, mm -hmm. and, and that right there, yeah. I think, unfortunately, has exacerbated the acceptance of being rude and getting in your face yes. and thinking that it's okay to mistreat people verbally. Carl, about 20 seconds. Look, this is hypocrisy. The same group that says that they're the tolerant ones and they want diversity and respect are the most disrespectful, intolerant, <laughs> hateful bunch you can come across. Mm -hmm. If you don't think exactly the same way they do, they get, they get right. hateful, spiteful, <clears throat> and they sometimes get violent. Okay, we got to. Mm -hmm. uh, people need to curb their anti antagonism. Curb their antagonism. <laughs> I blew the line. Derek Green, Carl DeMeo, Amy Tarkanian, thank you, folks. We'll be back after this.